and welcome to Greg's Gimme's. This morning we're out on the fourth hole and I'm standing in the hazard and as you know the fourth hole is a par three. Uh, it's a shorter par three but uh, there's a big a large wide uh, area of native grass and it's within the hazard. We're going to talk about some options that you have today. First option is use the hazard rules, uh, the, the drop rules. You're going to have a one stroke penalty but you might want to consider uh, reteeing. Uh, you can also drop and the forward tee box and the line that it went in the hazard and um, consider those things before you make a swing like this. Obviously the native grass is tall, it's going to affect the swing. Uh, you're not allowed to make any practice swings in here so you might want to make your practice swings outside the, the hazard. But just remember that the club is going to be slowed down and you're going to be distracted by the grass, the tall grass hitting your shaft or the club head. Uh, so focus on the, on the ball don't try to not be concerned with everything that's in the hazard the grass hitting the ball so I'm gonna uh, I picked a club uh, I have a, a pitching wedge because I need to make sure that it carries out of this bunker so anyway I'm gonna make a swing focus on the ball and not worry about what happens to the club or the shaft as I'm making the swing okay the ball came out of the out of the bunker they're out of the hazard it's up on the green, I'll have a putt, so I don't have a penalty shot. If you can focus, you can use that option. If you have any questions, come see me in the golf shop. Thanks for watching Greg's Gimmies.